Hi everybody, welcome to Turner Classic Movies. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. We have a lineup of westerns this afternoon and no self-respecting 24-7 uncut commercial free classic movie channel can feature a day of westerns without including a John Wayne movie. So up next from Warner Brothers in 1973, it's Cahill, United States Marshal. Wayne plays the title character, a typical Wayne role. He's a no-nonsense, tough federal marshal going about his business, rounding up bad guys, often spending long stretches of time away from home. But his rather black and white life is grayed when he discovers his two sons are mixed up in a bank robbery. The storyline was relatable for John Wayne. The Duke felt he had spent too much time away from his own family making movies. He made partial amends on Cahill U.S. Marshall because his son Michael Wayne produced the film through Wayne's production company, Batjack. The Duke's troubled kids in the movie are played by Gary Grimes and Clay O'Brien. They're joined by a top-notch supporting cast, including George Kennedy, Neville Brand, Marie Windsor, and Denver Pyle. There are cameos by Jackie Coogan, Harry Carey Jr., and Paul Fix, as well as a music score by Elmer Bernstein. The man calling the shots is the Duke's longtime friend, director Andrew McLaughlin. This is the fifth and final time McLaughlin directed Wayne. From 1973, here's Cahill, U.S. Marshal. Thank you. 